If I hit this, it should start recording. Perfect. Okay. I don't know why the up arrow is not working anymore on the, the Twitch beta studio, but probably because it's a beta. I don't know. Anyway. Welcome, everyone, to the Coma 2, Vicious Sisters. Um, I got this game in a uh, giveaway contest. My, uh, Jesus Christ. My controller is dusty. <laughs> yeah, I haven't used it for a while. Anyway, in the giveaway that my friend uh, was doing for uh, his Discord channel, I was like, hmm, that looks like it could be kind of neat. And uh, I decided to get it. So, we'll be playing it. I don't know much about it, other than the fact that it's kind of a spooky game. It looks like a, kind of like a side-scrolling visual novel at times horror game thing. So, we'll see how it goes. Real quick, I'm going to blow the dust off my uh, controller. I'll be right back. There we go, good as new. Good old canned air. Okay, so I set the, the options here. Apparently there's a confirmation button, which is A, and no other controls. Um, there's DLC, there's bonus, and there's star. I don't know what any of this is. I guess just like, ooh, fancy. Okay, there's DLC, which I don't think I have. I think it opens Steam, actually. Maybe? Or maybe it takes you in somewhere. Oh. Oh, you can, like, change her outfit, I guess, if you have the DLC? Okay. Anyway. Let's begin the game. Because I don't have DLC. Devspresso Games, huh? It's got an interesting art style, too. Kind of reminds me more of, like, a... Uh, uh, Walking Dead, but, like, more anime-ish. With the, uh, like, the... God, what is that style called? Cell shade? Seems like it's a Korean game, huh? Sewa High School. Okay. What a drag. Glad that's over. Says everyone ever after they get done with school. Well, it looks a little dark out for school, don't it? Huh? A message from Dahyun? Red alert. Meet me in the restroom when you're done chilling with Mad Dog. It's important. I'm spending time in his class willingly. Wonder what's so important. Okay, use the left control. Wait, what? Wait. If I wanted to use a keyboard, it had to be the left and right control? Oh my god. Use the accelerator key to run. Uh, running consumes stamina. That's the right trigger, okay. The interaction key to interact with your surroundings. Check the to-do list to see your, that's the right bumper, see your objectives. And check your location on the map with the up on the D-pad, okay. Meet Dahyun, okay. What do you have to say, male student? Incidentally, they all seem to have badges around their neck, except for me and that guy on the right. Find the best way to stay focused in maintaining a soul-crushing regimen. Oh. Today's no exception. I won't get home till midnight. What? Can I talk to the gal behind you? What about you guys? 
There'll be a super blood moon tonight. Fun fact, the last time one was seen in Korea was on the night of 1954. Nerd. So I can leave there, or... Mad Dog is Sewa High School's resident math teacher. He's good at his job, but has a reputation for being heavy-handed. Night study group program. Dinner. Okay. Dinner at that time. Korean history. Mathematics. Okay. There's a stamina bar. What are you two talking about? I don't get it. Why does Mad Dog like you so much? Must be nice living on Easy Street. What? Sometimes I hide in the class cabinet to catch some shut eye. What? That's what Don's called for distant measures. This guy. Announcement starting the summer. We are relocating the students of 3F to the room right of the main stairwell. The class will be reassigned 3-6 to better reflect Sewa's standard of excellence. F is not in our vocabulary. Oof. We'll henceforth use this room as the freshman after school study class. Principal Lee. Oh. So this is a after school study class? Lame. Uh. Oh, I gotta hold it down to leave. Okay. Hello, everyone. That's the classroom again. I should be dying at the restroom. Sorry, gentles' bathrooms are not a thing. The school blocked access to the roof after some students were discovered smoking up there. Wow, such degenerates. <gasps> Mina, you got that baseball hunk wrapped around your finger. Damn, some girls have all the luck. Indeed. Okay. Can I go downstairs? Nope. Okay. Mina Park, is that you? Come out, come out. I'm trying to concentrate in here. Sorry about that. Well, you know what they say, patience is a virtue. Come over it, so how's class? Same old. Oh, Chen Hu fell asleep and started smoking, snoring during the lecture. Mad I get so upset I thought he was gonna have a stroke. Well, spill the beans, what's so important? Oh, right, so I was, like, on my way to class when I bumped into Myung-gil. Not what I wanted to hear. Right, which reminds me, we gotta stop talk taking that route. I, like, keep bumping into those skanks from 252. Totes annoying. Can you get to the chase? Some of us have places to be. Okay. Don't go getting your panties into twist. Anywho... Myung-gi, like, handed me this and asked me to give it to you. You received Myung-gi's letter. So, what's it say? Hey, babe, we're way past the ninth inning, so how about we stop playing coy and go steady? Circle one, yes, no. Yours truly, myung -gi. Oh my god. Totally cringe. That, like, sent a legit shiver down my spine? This looks like it was written by a sixth grader. Surprised? Myung Gil isn't exactly known for his stunning intellect. So, what you gonna do? Since he likes baseball so much, maybe I'll wad this up and pitch it at his head. With any luck, he'll knock it far, far away from me. You know... He's kind of got a point, though. What do you mean? Don't you think it's about time you, like, stop leading him on? I'm not leading him on. I just don't want to, you know, crush him. You've been complaining about him for the past year. Stop being indecisive. Just suck it up and tell him he struck out already. I'll handle it. Indecisive? Why don't you tell me what you really think? It's not rocket science. You either like him or you don't. I, for one, am starting to think you like the attention. You forget it. I'll deal with it myself. Well, whatever you decide, do it quick. I'm getting tired of him hounding me. 
Anyway, let's talk about it later. I gotta get to Miss Song's class. Now, oh, darn it. What's up? I haven't eaten yet, and I left my purse in class. Do me a favor and go grab a Ohana bar in the cafeteria. I'll owe you one. I'll meet you there in a bit. Hurry up. You have enough money for a snack? Check your inventory. Mina keeps her inventory in her backpack. It has four slots for items at the moment, so choose wisely. Quest items are stored in a different pouch of the backpack. They can't be removed or used like regular items. Okay. Mineral water, refreshing all natural stamina flow recovers. Okay. Wait. Damn! I don't know how much that money translates to in, like, US dollars, but that's an amount. Okay. And then downstairs to the cafeteria, I guess. What's this? Is this like the teacher's lounge or something? First aid. Something else. I don't need any of that right now. Oh, this is the cafeteria. Okay. What's this? Use coins to buy items from vending machines. Make sure Mina has an empty slot in inventory. Oh, hot bar. Oh, it's a chocolate bar. Damn. I don't think I'd want a uh, chocolate bar. It's already been opened and partially eaten from a vending machine, though. This is health by one. Health by two. Fully restores health. Ooh. I don't know. It seems like this burger is the way to uh, go in terms of buying things. Like, why would you want these two, which do one health, for half the price of one that fully recovers your health? Even this one for two health. I guess if you're, like, really hurting for money, you'd want to buy these. But uh, if you, like, could spring it, why not get that, you know? That's just stamina... Become refreshed. Stamina recovers faster. Become energized. Stamina does not deplete. Ooh! Nice. How about this one? What's this one got? Is that... Oh, it's mace. I thought it was lipstick. Escape your enemy's grasp. Health bar. We got spicy chips again. A burger. And that stuff. Okay. So, even though this is... <laughs> looks like a medical vending machine. It, uh, it's just got mace in it, huh? Okay. Don't really need that right now. What if you two say, you know that old woman, an old man Ma got the nickname Mad Dog? I think it comes from the way before our time. I guess we'll have us die hard, huh? She looks upset. Yeah. Our district's new vending machines have a little something for everyone. Ohana bars are my favorite. I read they sourced the cocoa from Boreno in Hawaii. I mean, it makes sense this Ohana if it's uh, from Hawaii. Can't go that way. <laughs> okay. Uh. Well, that's sketchy. Oh. It's just him. Okay. What? I can't talk to him now. Stall for me. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Oi. Yo, rash girl. Don't call me that. Hey, by the long face, I'm just joshing you. One of the senior girls from 2-5 told me that was your nickname. <laughs> well, you shouldn't listen to them. What are you doing here anyway? Not much. Heading down to the diamond to get some swings on. So, uh, you see Mina around? Uh, Mina? Nope, haven't, uh, seen her lately. But you gave her the note, right? What'd she say? Looked like she was in a rush, so I don't think she, like, had a chance to read it. No. I'll tell her what the... Yeah. Yo! <laughs> you deaf sozer? Get your punk ass over here. Uh... Mina... 
What are you looking at? I don't have all day, bread shuttle. Uh, hey. You got my pizza bread. You know I can't play ball with a jam on an empty stomach. All right, I've had enough of this. Mina, get out here. <laughs> what the hell, Mina? That was like, seriously uncool. Why'd you call me out? He was totally buying your story. You're the one who should like, put me on the spot. Oh my God. Did you see his face when he bum rushed past him like that, Ed? And did you wear, hear what he called me? Ugh, no offense. But you do this all the time. You're super flaky. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? It means you need to like, grow a spine. This isn't the first time you've left me high and dry. Whatever. Time to blow this popsicle stand. Deal with your own issues from now on. Okay, bye. Drama queen. What's her deal? I'm late. I should to miss Long's class now. Where's it at, though? Ooh. They just... Okay. No, I can't go in there? Huh. I'd rather avoid those seniors. They look like trouble. I mean, they do. That one on the left looks like a total delinquent. The one in the middle is the mastermind. The one on the right's the muscle. The one on the left, he just like intimidates people with his face, but he's actually really a pushover. That's how it goes. Up or down? So that was his classroom. Okay, so it's gotta be down below, okay. Ooh, heartbeat starts if you're uh, running too much. I don't have time to go downstairs right now. Where the fuck is it? What? Okay. So, wait, where am I going? Am I going back to the same classroom? That seems wrong. Hello, I guess I'm going in here? Nope. Not that way. Here? All right. Everyone, pipe down. We're switching to English now. How are y'all doing today? <laughs> they didn't. They didn't voice this. <laughs> I'm fine, thank you. And you? I'm doing well today, class. I want to introduce the newest member of Sewa High. He'll be helping everyone. I don't know why I gave her like a, a, a deep refined voice. Uh, fuck me. He'll be helping everyone improve English this summer. Hello class, my name is Chance. I'm very excited to meet you all. Sorry I can't stay today, but I'm happy to say hi. We'll talk more tomorrow. See you later, Chance. I'm sure you've all been waiting to see your exams. I'll hand them out at the end of class. We'll be finishing up a little earlier. I want you all to see the Super Blood Moon tonight. It's a rare occurrence. But for now, please open your books to page 84. Teacher's fucking hot. Dude, Jesus Christ, 10 p.m. class ends? Fuck me. B plus is pretty decent. Really? They kept you after class for that? It'll be a relief to go home. Looks like I'm the last one out. Yeah, that's sketchy. Isn't that? Seho, what's he doing there? It's the old storage room. I thought it was locked. Why would you? Why would you do that? Why would you go there? I'd be like, not my problem. I'm leaving. But nope, we're gonna witness a murder, or something like that. We'll see. We all see. Could have just sworn I saw him come in here. 
Seho. Where did he go? Yeah, time to leave. Oh, apparently not. Okay. Yep. That's a little sketchy. Alright, I can only interact with this. I can see the super blood moon rising from here. It's quite a sight to behold. Okay, that candle turned on. Oh, I guess I'm looking at this. Someone has assembled an odd makeshift shrine here. There's a picture here. So the same girl from Yoho's Amulet? What's this writing? Tonight the fourth and final blood moon of the dark uh, Tetrad rises. And when the great gnashing begins, the um, uh, Umbran ugh, gates shall open and welcome my vicious sister to walk our world. Only then will she relinquish her claim on my damned soul. I... I don't feel so well. It worked. It really worked. And you brought the amulet. This is just perfect. You normies are so predictable. Heh. <laughs> Someone's coming. Them again. Damn. 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 Why don't they just leave me alone? Was that Seha? And the kid got away. Again. He's deceptively fast. Dropped this, though. It's a priest? Hmm. That's not the relic we're looking for. It's just a worthless lighter. Do you recognize this girl? I've seen her before. She's a Seho student from Song's class. Oh, that's Chance. How'd she get in the coma? That's not our concern. Stay focused. We've got a big fish to fry. This little bird will be lucky if she even makes it through to the witching hour. Where's Hyung Bae? I haven't seen him since we arrived. He has more pressing priorities. Just catch that thwerp before he causes any more trouble. I'll find the moon incense. Everyone else, you know the mass minister's orders. Remember, our realms are only in sync tonight. We're operating in uh, liminal time and can't afford to make mistakes. No use waiting around, then. Let's move out. Well, this is some sketchy Cthulhu-esque stuff, huh? Wh what's going on? What time is it? Oh my god. Did I pass out here? I can't see a thing. What's this? You received the strange lighter. The strange lighter can be used to brighten your surroundings. You can search for certain items with it. Be careful. Your enemies will find you easier if it's by its glow. Check your location with the maps. The Book of Memories, location, lootable areas, and hiding spots are important places to note. Okay. How do I, uh... Oh no! I just ate something! Fuck! How do I, uh... Okay. X puts it away. An open book sits upon the desk. You see several names hastily scrawled on the pages. Stay vigilant and do not lose yourself in the coma. Write your name in the Book of Memories and remember who you are. Why us? My name? Hmm. One's name is important in the coma. Forgetting it will cause Mina to lose her sanity and relive her nightmares. Use the Book of Memories to record Mina's name. You're going to start from these areas. Okay. So X opens and closes the lighter. Hey, no. Yeah. Ah! The bodies look just like they are made of wax. Their unnatural poses make it an eerie sight. In this place, it's not right. I've got to snap out of it. This would be some kind of bad dream. The uh, lady on the left, 100%, looks like uh, the teacher. At least with her skirt. That was really tight. Falling bodies may drop from the ceiling. If you're struck by one of them, your health will drop by one. If you're struck by crawling hands, you'll begin bleeding. This will temporarily decrease your maximum health. You will lose one health, or lose one health from bleeding if you don't use a bandage. 
Evasion uses a lot of stamina. However, it may mean the difference between life and death. Oof, okay. Okay, I gotcha. I think. Let me just... Oop! Ha, you thought. This is a long hallway. Is it just repeating? Maybe? Mm. Yeah, that's a long ass hallway. Okay, I didn't really think it was gonna let me go this far. Uh, map? Muse location denotes her current location. Discovered utilities will be marked on the map. Question mark denotes an area of interest. Exclamation point the notes an area that should be explored. Okay. So, basically I'm trying to go to the bottom floor and leave. Okay. Gotcha. There's an underground parking lot? Huh. Holes. Okay. Oop. Nah, nah. Okay. Let uh, I think we have to go all the way to the other side, or we can get down those stairs here. We gotta go further down. I'm assuming we're gonna have to go further to the right, cause why would they not have you go all the way through here? I need a key card for that. Okay, must be the teacher's lounge or something like that. A wall of Eldritch tentacles have taken root and grown through the hall. Oh, well, bye. She looks she's so panicked when she runs. Gotta keep that stamina up. Me being the person I am, I'm uh I would I would walk away from the door that just randomly slammed on me, but you received a torn page. Torn pages you collect will appear in notes. These pages may provide revealing lore. Okay. A fateful day, Sumi. <clears throat> August 15th, 1945. It was the day of my seventh birthday. The nation celebrated its independence for the first time in 35 years. My father believed it to be a good omen that his daughter's birthday should fall on such a day. My mother scolded him for being too superstitious. At the end of that month, he suddenly announced we were selling our land and moving to Seoul to seek better opportunities and to be closer to his brother. As a young girl, I still remember the journey to the big city and felt like ages. To while away the hours, my brother taught me how to play his recorder. He would continue to tutor me long after. Those sessions are now precious memories. Okay. Gotcha. Okay. Hiding may save your life. Use your surroundings to conceal yourself. Hiding different spots will provide varying levels of concealment. Choose wisely. Complete a quick time command to hold your breath. Failing will reveal your location. Uh oh. It's more difficult to conceal heavy breathing when your stamina is low. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. Before we go down, I right, nothing here. I can't believe they let me do this. Exit's it's right here, huh? And it's locked. Anyone there? Let me out. Well, we can't get out that way. Nope, the science lab's locked. And dodge! Oh, ho ho! Almost had me. That one's locked as well. Are those beds? Oh, 
Ha! You thought. It needs that needs power or a key card. Maybe both. Wait. Oh, I can go further down. Okay. That's the medical area. I need a key card. Okay, so there's a generator powering this one. But I need a key card. Okay. What's this? I found one coin. Uh, fight currency struck in the shape of a coin. Purchase items from vending machines. Okay. What about this one? Hey, more money. And this one? You received a torn page. Learning English. The Sewa Institute bolstered his presence in Se uh, Song Ryung during 1945 and 1949. They inaugurated Sewa Hospital and expanded the Sewa Academy, which had been opened since 1932. Westerners largely staffed both facilities. So Suho attended the academy and became fluent in English. He had a natural command of it, and his intelligence was a source of great pride from my parents. He even taught me how to read and write the language. My admiration for him grew with ugh, each passing day. I wanted to be just like him. I'm still practicing using the recorder he gave me so many years ago. It was my personal way of following his footsteps. Okay. More Eldritch tentacles. Okay, so... I guess we try to go down further. Parking garage needs power. So if I look at the map... So... I wish it would... So it looks like the, uh... The, like, tree-looking things in the staff office in the school lobby are, uh, the... The growths. I wish it would tell me the same thing on the, uh, the stairs. Like, one part of the stairs would be like, blah, you know what I'm saying? Underground storage. Oh, it's open. I want to leave through the underground parking lot. Why? We, we can't get there, though. I guess I have to check the door on the right? Oof. Maybe it wanted me to, uh, go all the way to the right, figure that door was locked, and then go all the way to the left door, figure it was locked, and then, okay, maybe I just skipped a bunch of stuff here. You missed me. Alright. Let's go up. I can't even register it. Damn, okay. I was hoping maybe I could be like, let me try to go up, and I was like, oh, nope, there's stuff there. Did I check this bathroom? Is this the one that we were in before? I think so, yeah. I wanted to make sure I couldn't collect anything there. Alright. So this needs a key card. Does doing that register anything? Nope. Okay. I thought maybe it would be like, you need a key card for this. How about this door? Nope. This one's locked. So ignoring that for now. Anything else here? Page. So a torn page. The Sewa Institute. The months after our arrival in Seoul were turbulent. To my father's dismay, it was a dangerous time of political upheaval. My family settled in an underdeveloped city district called Song Ryung. I'm gonna mispronounce the shit of these names. My family settled. Uh, yeah, yeah. Two. Uh, it was most notable for two things then: the district presence of Catholic missionaries and the permanence of the Sewa Institute, owned by a mysterious American family. Our community knew the organization well for its various outreach efforts, despite the benefits of their development projects did for our district. A suspicious fog of secrecy clouded the uh, institute. Okay. Okay, up we go. Let's go left first. That's locked. That's locked. Oh, I can get in the boys' bathroom. Nope. I can hide in here. Nothing else, though. Okay. 
Seems like bathrooms are used for hiding, huh? Okay. First things first. Bandages, cures bleeding, cures poisoned. Escape your enemy's grasp. Okay. Let's buy a bandage first of all. I'm gonna grab some some mace as well. I saw that over there. Let's buy a uh, food thing just in case. That girl. Hey, are you okay? She doesn't look right. Maybe I shouldn't get too close. Crawling shadows will slash at your legs. If you're struck by them, you will bleed. They may be difficult to detect. Keep an eye out for them. Okay. I just go like, Ugh. yeah, you fuck. These containers are marked with an odd emblem. These supplies come courtesy of the minister. Take what you need to finish the job. Ghost vigilantes, Kyung Bay. Because they've been opened. I wonder if there's anything else useful inside. Bandages. Okay. Fuck. What a. No, no, not that. Okay. The the right. I need to move my microphone. Hold on. Eh. Okay. So the right joystick changes what I'm selected on, and then the left bumper touches it. Gotcha. I can record my presence here. Now let's open this. See what I get. Coin! Hell yeah! It wasn't something that I, uh... Would go to my inventory. No! Your inventory's full. You need more space for that. Okay, so I can put it back and get it back later. Excellent. That's just a really black wall, huh? The gate's locked too? Come on. Maybe the staff left keys behind at the bar. I better check. A torn page. It's the first entry. Cool. It was autumn of 1938 that I was born to a family of humble means. For seven years, we lived in our small family house in uh, Guangzhou. My father worked as a farmer, harvesting rice and barley. Mother worked at the cotton mills. My older brother, Suho, and I tended to our chores our parents couldn't see to. In those years, everyone carried their weight. That's what was expected. And we did so with great dil diligence. Those were difficult years, but we were happy because we had the great comfort of each other's company and laughter. Okay. Checking the bar for keys. A hastily written note. A memo to cafeteria staff. We received the cafeteria memo and key card. Seems a food service worker was working overtime. They were told to pick up an underground parking lot key card in the security office. Maybe I can finally get out of this creepy place. Okay. So I've got a, uh, uh, what, what's the bag? Is it down? Yeah. So I've got a staff key card, access to facilities reserved for staff, a memo, and a B plus. Okay. Catch you later. All right. Just gonna go to do that. All right. So map. Okay. Cool. So it marks that there's a vending machine and a uh, save point there. A moment. Apartment's getting a little chilly. Gonna throw on my lab coat. All right. Let's settle in and get nice and snug. Okay. Some study rooms. Okay, I gotcha. Computer lab, huh? Hmm. All right, headmaster's office is that way. So, we started on this floor. Check those bathrooms already. That one's locked, that one's locked, that one's barred, that one's locked. Oh, I can open this one. Oh. This is a little monk ass. Oh, I can hide under here, okay. Oh, nothing else here. I guess that's what's barring that door, though. 
Wait. Oh. That door's barred. That door's locked. That one's locked as well. It'll be good, Rockus, to mark all this stuff off. I think I came from that room. All right. So now we go down. Then we go down again. The vending machine. What's this one got? Ah, same stuff, pretty much. Okay. Then we find out that the school's officer memo says there's an underground parking lot with the security key. Okay. So I basically just skipped some stuff here. Shop area, right? Technology and home economics lab, yep. We shall convert the school science class to a technology and home economics lab. So high students must learn to appreciate practical skills like engineering, sewing, cooking, and craftsmanship. After all, shouldn't you at least be able to replace a light bulb? Headmaster. It's locked. Here's the other side of that. Okay. We have not checked out the fourth floor yet. Let's check out this side of the area. That's barred, of course. That needs power. Ooh, a chest. I got some money. Okay. Don't really even need the like lighter, do I? I guess it did say, like, yeah, you can only see certain things with it. Right, upstairs. This is when we ran across. Let's check upstairs here. So nothing too spooky yet. Just kind of unsettling. This one seems to be locked. So I think if it has a little, like, a... Uh... Oh, never mind. Water up here. Money here. Okay. So the study room three has stuff in it. I'm not going to remember that, but. Slate! Like... How about this room? Anything useful here? Doesn't look like it. This one? Nope. How about the bathroom we talked to our friend in? I'm beginning to think that the bathrooms are only for hiding in. That's what it's seeming to be so far. I think with that, we've checked all the rooms we can actually get to. And we gotta go to the central staircase. Further down. I think then we gotta go to the left one. Where I want to go. Wait, I'm on the first floor. Never mind. I gotta go to the middle one. That needs power. Right, so I can get the security office. I can hide in the locker, of course. Hmm. Ah. 
That's a real body. A real blood. Hmm. Yeah, he got a little fucked. My phone refuses to work at a time like this. Okay, calm down. Just focus on getting out of here. A wallet. His name was Hyung Bae. I don't recognize him though. Underground parking lot key card. Isn't it the guy who like dropped off all of the uh, the stuff? Like the loot, the crates from the minister, I think? Looks like mace. Doesn't have tried to use it. Doesn't look like it helped though. What could have done this to him? Might come in handy. Mace is a disposable item used to escape from assailant's grasps. A quick time command will appear when you're captured. Complete the command to use the spray. I don't care one at a time. Damn, okay. Well, remember, we have that there. Alright, now we can go to the underground supply closet. I don't know why I'm not going to take one of these knives that's sticking out of him. The red knife looks very, like, powerful. It was it will split the guy in half. Parking lot's downstairs. Let's get out of here. Okay. Just double check here. Nope, okay. And it's locked. No good, the key card won't work unless it has power. Okay. Well, I guess we're gonna take a look over here then. Must be some kind of backup generator in here. Alone underground, this is how I never imagined my night. The big machine's broken. Hey, a save point. Hell yeah. Later. What's this? Oh, that goes out. Oh, not where I wanted to go. Back in here, please. We didn't search all the way that way. Okay. A torn page. The summer of 1950. <clears throat> Nothing could have prepared us for the horror to come in the summer of 1950. Our entire district fell into turmoil when word arrived that North Korean forces had crossed the 38th parallel. My family listened to the radio announcement of President Rhee, who urged citizens to stay in Seoul and trust the government in spite of the impending danger. My family knew it was coming, so we quickly packed what we could carry and fled to the burning city on foot. We made it across the Han Bridge, moments before our own forces destroyed it. It was the most difficult journey in our lives. Through much suffering and heartache, we finally found our way to Busan, the last city standing. It was there that Suho, a then 16-year-old boy, announced he would join other students as volunteer soldiers. I protested in anger to no avail. This looks like the generator. It might be able to restart the power here. Before we do that, though, is this a place to hide? Yep, okay. Well, as soon as I hit the power, that's gonna happen. A bandage that I can't use. Water that I can't. Of course, I decided to buy stuff with all this loot hanging around. I saw you up there, hand. Don't think I didn't. Oop. Fuck. Down, up, down. Okay. Didn't realize we were doing a quick time event there. Okay. Sounds like it worked. Uh oh. Uh oh. She yelled. That's a mistake. Nope. Nope, that's not Miss Song. Uh oh. What? Yeah, that's the thing. So... Yeah. 
Imagine not thinking to open up the cabinet. I think she just passed. Got her on the other ground parking lot now. Run! Later. Please stop. Like a tentacle haired monster is gonna stop. Nice duck. God damn. Beep beep. Random person on a motorcycle. Get on now. Yeah, she can't keep up. It's a motorcycle. I'd hope not. Wait, who are you? Get inside and some fun were saved. I'm going to lead her away. Who was that? Indeed, who was that? The uh, police office, huh? Well. Was that Miss Song? Something terrible was wrong. I don't think that I could get any stranger. He dropped me off near the police office. I will better file a report. <laughs> Mom and Dad must be worried right now, so I'm sure they'll feel relieved to hear from me. Hey, miss, you okay? You okay? You, you in the car, you good? Hey, you. Someone ahead. Wait, is that Seho? What's he doing here? <laughs> Mina, how'd you get here? I was locked in the school. I barely got out. Hey, I need to talk to an officer. Something crazy happened back there. I need to send someone to check out Seho. Hold your horses. Look, you're hyperventilating. Why don't you calm down and tell me what happened? I can help you. There was a murder at Sewa. Miss Song, I, I think she... It just sounds too crazy to say. I think she killed some guy named Hyung Bae. What? That's insane. Miss Song would never do something like that. Now it all makes sense. What do you mean? What are you doing here? I was near the school when I heard a scream. I just ran over here to tell the police, but they brushed me off. Maybe they'll finally believe me when they hear your report. Seriously? That's so messed up. Come on, let's go together. Go ahead. I'm right behind you. Yeah, sure you are. Looking at my fucking ass. I would be. <laughs> Seho, this place looks cl- Huh? Seho? Sounds like the door is being boarded from the outside. Of course it is. We're gonna have to kill that fat boy. Make yourself comfortable in there, Mina. Trust me, it's for your own good. Let me out of here. Has everyone gone insane? This, uh, this poster here on the left has a very wide smile. As does that one. Hmm. Tentacles. I thought there were always at least a few officers on duty. Really? <laughs> I feel like I woke up some kind of middle zombie apocalypse. Okay, Mina, can you stop being dumb? Like, let, let's be real honest here, Mina. Shit is not okay right now. Okay, I figured it was locked. I remember this poster. I came with a class president of Sewa representatives for a photo shoot promoting community safety. Has to be someone here who remembers me. Hey, look, it's me. <laughs> What's this? Hello? This reception desk is empty. I'm not holding my breath for any help here. Ooh, a bag. Hey, 500 won. Won, won. Security cameras appear to be active. Could someone be on duty in the security room? Is this a walker or what? what is this? Like a bunch of pipes and wood? What's this? 
No good, I can't open the door without the proper key card. Well, time to loot around the police station. Found some water that I can't hold. Ooh, another note. Let's get a torn page. Cleaning duty, Seho Gil. My strange journey started in the most mundane way possible. As usual, Myung Gil had been causing problems for Taehoon and I. One day we tried to. Wait. I think this is uh, about that jock guy. We tried uh, shuttling bread for him and his goon squad. When things came to a head, it got our teacher Mad Dog's attention. I thought he'd side with us against the bullies, but the old fart put us on storage room cleaning duty. We started that evening after school. The room looked like it hadn't been dusted in half a century. While Taehoon went about cleaning with the diligence of a bee, I used the extra time to look through some boxes. <clears throat> Key card. Can't go this way. Is that gonna map for me now? I don't have a map of this place yet. Ugh. It'll say yes, right? Yeah. Hello, emasimated man holding a box. How you doing? Oh, I can just hide there. Never mind. You found some trips. You received a torn page. I'm gonna wait to read all these in order. No sense uh, reading them out of order right now. So I wonder if, if I wouldn't have escaped in the underground area, but instead kept like running around the school, would I have been able to go to those other like locked rooms that I couldn't get into before without the key card? Maybe. What's this? A map of the facility. Hell yeah. Easy peasy. Ooh, an armory. That's the one that was locked. Okay. Interrogation room. Yep, yep. Nothing here. Does the chief know one of them escaped? If we don't deal with this now, we can kiss our jobs goodbye. Okay, someone escaped, it sounds like. These arms wrapped around these chests. What does this memo say? I had that strange nightmare again. I was choking on toxic fumes right here in the building. It felt so real. Officer Kim. Okay. Just a couple of memos in here. Oh, can't go this way. At least it marked it off for me. Shame it doesn't mark off the stairs. That'd be useful. That's the security room. Alright, so the way up way below the place to go is up, it looks like. Huh. So if Oh no. Okay. I'm trying to see what exactly, where I can go from where. It looks like, so the far right staircase is blocked, so I can't go down that way, but there's that uh, like elevator looking stairwell um, that's second from the left on the first floor that I can use to go down to the generator room or the other staircase or something. I don't know. Don't grab my legs, sir. desk. Vending machine, vending machine, what have you got for me? Nothing, because I don't have any uh, spare room. This goes down to the lobby? Hmm, okay. I had to go up further, I think. Or the likely I have to go to the chief's office. Oh, this room. What we got here? A place to hide. A couple of bags to inspect. Hey, money. It's always good. All right. I 
An unpleasant odor reminiscent of rotten fish lingers in the air. Ah, that plant's spreading noxious fumes. I better hold my breath. Blighted tentacles may burst and spread toxic gas. Be careful around them. If Mina breathes the gas, she'll become poisoned. This will cause your health to drop over time. Oh, great. You can't catch me with that shit. Guess I gotta go through the meeting room. So it's like some sort of meeting room. Indeed. Oh, what's this? Papers? No tech duty officers. Make sure you're carrying the newly issued tasers when you head out on patrol. With the local protesters are heating up, that could mean the difference between coming home safely and being on the receiving end of a serious injury. To all officers, local business owners, shopkeepers, and residents are planning to assemble near uh, Dokuberi Market to hold a demonstration at 8 a.m. As some of you may have heard, they'll be protesting City Hall's plans to reappropriate land for new building projects. I want everyone to assemble early and make sure we can keep them in line. A poison antidote that I can't use. The officers must have held a meeting here recently. Someone left this behind. Looks like a key card of some sort. Fucking pog champ. So I just can't dwell there for too long. Okay. I think I got it. All right, so we'll go there. There's nowhere to go up, so we gotta go back down. Up, down, turn around. Okay, so we can use the key card here. This place is a mess. What happened here? <gasps> is someone there? Hold on a second, miss. I'm gonna loot some stuff here. Okay. Hello, miss. She looks like a student, but I don't recognize her school uniform. Ah, it's one of the ladies who uh, was talking while we were knocked unconscious. Ugh. You. How did you get in here? It's not important right now. What happened to you? I've been poisoned. You need to come with me. We gotta get you out of here. No, I better not move. We need to find some help now. Calm down. Panicking is only going to get us killed. Is that what you want? No. And pay attention. Nobody's coming to help us here. Our lives are in grave danger at this very moment. Every minute belongs to us. That brings us, especially me, closer to death. But I need you to take what I'm about to say seriously. You feel it, don't you? This place is not your world. We're in the coma. The shadow realm connected to the waking world. She has a lot of, like, tags around her neck. Are you sure you didn't hit your head? Listen. If you want to survive the night, we need to work together. Help me and I can help get us out of here. What do you need me to do? You know the nearby market? Yeah, I know it well. My mother shops there all the time. Go there for me. Wait, I can't leave. Say ho, my schoolmate locked me in the building. There's one more way out of this building. I can buzz you out the back gate, but I'll need... You'll need... I'll need a high-ranking officer's key card to do so. Try searching the chief's office on the third floor to see if you can find something that works. Take this. You'll need it to stay in touch with me. It's the only phone that works here. A Nokia. Nice. The Shadow Telecom. This phone looks ancient. Okay, I'm going now. So what's your name? You can call me Yesel. Yesel, huh? I'm Mina Park. All right, get going. I literally don't have all night. Shadow Telecoms use a special frequency in the coma. Use it to communicate with the ghost vigilantes. Ghost vigilantes don't always answer, but when they do, you may learn valuable clues. Cool story. Okay. Uh, let's save over this one. Okay. I mean, couldn't we like? This will say the chief's office is on the third floor. Hope she's right. Couldn't we like give her that uh, antidote or whatever we found? So. I guess I go up here, and then who knows what's creeping around here. 
Better be careful. Who's that? Could it be? Hello. Miss Song? How can I help you, Mina Park? What, what, Miss Song? Uh, what are you doing here? I'm going to sever that pretty little head from your body. Now get over here. Okay, Scorpion, damn. Mina, what's going on? The CCTV feeds are cutting out. It's Miss Long. She's stalking me, but yes, it has to be her. She looks just like my teacher. Fish's sister hasn't uh, dominated this domain. Her flesh, Thrall's powers, haven't fully manifested yet. Mina, find that key now. Just try to stay out of her way. Yep. Where the fuck am I at now? Hey. Oh, you almost got me! If I didn't have a habit of sprinting everywhere, you would have fucking got me! Oopsie. Oh, you found me! Ha! Ha ha! Fancy that! Nope, nope, she got me again. Damn it. Get, get out! You dumb bitch! <laughs> Oh, nuts. Okay. Mina was killed. I was, uh... Not expecting that. I always forget that if you're hiding and there's a monster, that you gotta do a fucking... Thing. Yes, a thing. Indeed. Okay. Now we go over here, up here, and breaking glass. Let me see Miss Song. I'm gonna say I still would though. Okay. Yep. Oops. That's real quick, let's just save so I don't have to go through that again. I'm a dumbass. Alright, so we go out. I gotta go all the way to the left side. Excellent. She's going to the left. What is this room? Oop, what's this? Oh, I can hide here, never mind. Which all that is. Who the hell does Chief Cha thinks he's ordering me to fix that damn pipe? I'm an officer, not a plumber. Oops, that was a note. Alright, torn page. Okay. The Rosewood Recorder. I found a leather case with brass latches while rummaging through one box. I remember feeling instantly drawn to it. It was like the rush you get while gaming on a PC room when you discover some kind of unique item during your dungeon run. Imagine my disappointment when I found out it was just some crappy Rosewood Recorder. I'm not musically inclined, so I asked Tahoon if he knew how to play it. He said it looked old and useless, and he wouldn't dream of putting that near his mouth. I guess the con contrarian in me didn't appreciate his misvatitude, so I took it home. Uh-oh. That's probably the recorder from here, huh? Okay, let's check the bathrooms quick. That 
is locked. Sir, could you not twitch like that, please? There's some kind of strange body here. It's not a body per se. It's what remains of the Sohan police officer Shade. What do you mean, Shade? Shades are powerful spirits. They manifestation of rumors, emotions, and unique history to local area. The one you've stumbled upon is just another of the vicious sister's victims. Spirits, you're serious. The coma is real? We don't need to get into the details now. Just look around and see if you can find it there. Okay. Key card's in here. Okay. What about this? Nothing of value in the chief's desk. There's like a journal of some sort. Seemed to belong to the chief. I think Sarge is going through a midlife crisis, or maybe it has something to do with his recent divorce. He brought a new car and has been trying to get back into shape. Naturally, he came to me for some advice. I started him on a ketogenic diet. We've got a regular workout scheduled at 1 p.m. every day, too. I'll show him how real games are made. No mention of the key card. Maybe I'll give you a solo ring again. If you're lost and need advice, try calling someone else on the telecom. Okay. But before we do that... Hmm. I guess we have to. Call your soul. Your soul. Pick up! Still luck finding the key card? Nope, but I did find the chief's journal. Seemed like he was obsessed with working out. Interesting. That's a good start, considering his daily routine, and... Check those areas. They're bound to be useful leads. Okay, so go to the gym. Where's the gym? On the right. Okay. It was the one more past this. This one? Oh, I thought those were katanas, not barbells. Weird. Found it. I found the chief security pass. Great work. We'll finally be able to open the gates. All right, get out of there and get back to the security office. Time's of the essence. So I think... Yeah, I need to go this way. <laughs> okay, down, down. Now we're on this floor to the security room. Wait, hold on. Okay, I didn't recognize the symbol of Yolslo over there on the other one. I was like, what the hell? Get in here before she fucking sees me. Let's do a quick save. Yo, yo, yo. Let me see it. Perfect. You should do the trick, but I'll have to let you out from here. I'll monitor your movements through the security cameras. When you get to the back gate near the underground parking lot, you should know. Uh, you'll hear a buzz. That's all you know the door's open. What do you need me to get from the market? There's an apothecarian who has a shop there. Ask him to mix a dose of plasma tonic. That doesn't sound like any kind of remedy I've heard of. Don't worry about that. Just remember to ask for it. This should cover it. Da, 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 da. I received Hellion? What's this? Nobody's gonna take these. It's called Hellion, the only currency worth a damn at the market. Trust me. Alright, you're the boss. But don't blame me if I return empty handed. Okay. Just do another quick save here. So I need to go to parking garage there. Hold on. Ooh, almost fucked that up. Come on. Oh yeah. Oh hey. Looks like the police armory. Maybe I could find something to defend myself with. Doubt it. I found some sort of crafting desk. You should try 
to MacGyver something useful out of any loot you've picked up. MacGyver? You know that American TV show with the guy who... Never mind. You really don't know who MacGyver is? Should I? He's kind of famous, even in Korea. To be fair, I guess it's before your time. Just try to improve, improvise something you can use. Get to be creative. Use crafting tables to create useful items with the resources you found. Okay. I can put this crafting desk to use with the right items. So, it doesn't really tell me how to use it then. So, antidote. A bar. Hey, this is a restricted area. Are you a cop? Do I look like a regular B cop to you? So you shouldn't be in here either? You got a smart mouth on you, kid. I'm here looking for officer's badge. You can't seem to find it. Who the hell are you? An undercover officer? That makes sense. They even got a uniform for you. So why do they send you to the armory? I'm looking for something to defend myself with. Why are you here? The officers took their tasers before leaving. Not much left now. Tasers can come in handy for what I'm up against. You can assemble the taser to the crafting table. I don't have all the parts, though. There's a grip over there. You still need a lithium magazine, though. Officers usually keep spare magazines in their work desks. I have a extra tasable cartridge. I'll be willing to give you if you find my officer's badge. All right, no problem. Getting back to work now. Okay. useful, but I think it connects to something else. You received a grip. Okay, so does that go to, like, key items, or...? Okay, it does. Okay. Interesting. So I gotta find his badge, and then I can make a taser, huh? Okay, so I can't go down this way. How am I gonna reach the parking lot? Hmm. Has to be the way around. Yeah, we'll figure it out. But first, he says something about uh, the work desks, huh? So we gotta go back to the chief's desk and search his desk? Is that what we gotta do? What was in here? Food, right. Don't need that right now. Ha! You almost got me! Ah, he wouldn't have his badge in the woman's bathroom. We just need to kind of check everywhere to make sure we can find his badge. Nope, can't go in there. Why can't I go in there? What's this? Received a lithium magazine. Oh, nice. Not what I was looking for, but I'll take it. Is that just the uh, sticky note? Yep, okay. Need to find a badge. If I were a badge, where would I be? Maybe in here. Nope. What about here? Back in the gym, maybe? I don't see anything here. Okay, so I can just run past those things. I don't have to actually look like I'm crouch next to them or anything. What's this? There's a toolbox here. It may have something useful inside. A little bunch of assorted plumbing equipment. Well, don't know what else I was expecting. Hmm, this might come in handy, though. Engineer key. Okay, that wasn't here before. The building shakes with the sound of maniacal laughter. There's a strange chill in the air. I'm getting goosebumps. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get in here real quick. No? Okay. Could you stop that, please? Spaz. Can't go in there. Maybe the chief confiscated his ID? Hmm. 
Or his badge, whatever we're looking for. Nope! Uh, down. Get fucked, bitch! I'll go down here, actually, real quick. What? You hussy. Okay. Well, shit. Like, I didn't even get a chance to do the quick time event. It was like, now nah, you're just gonna die. I guess, because I didn't have anything to do it with. That's why. So is this after I got the, uh... Hold on. Backpack. I got the batteries. Okay. So we'll need to do anything up here. So I can kind of just boogie down to the next floor. Right? Yeah. I suppose. I've already searched this area, though. I'll just go back down again. Oh no, the fucking plumbing key. Fuck. Well, let's find this guy's badge first. What's this? Single moment attached to the door. Uh, actually, fix the key. Ah, oh, shit. Okay, fuck you, first of all, lady. That's rude. What? What? Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> Damn you! Okay. So I need the engineer's key to get into there. But where's this asshole's badge? Also, why don't I take the engineering key? So, where the fuck would it be? It's gotta be in the down below area then. So, it's either, where's my mouse? Okay, can't see my mouse. So it's either in the staircase, generator room, evidence area, the parking floor. There's nothing else anywhere here. Except for the depository in the meeting room? Fuck. Okay. Hold on, I got this. Hit a bitch! Oh, there's no way to hide in here. Damn it. Oh, well, this is gonna hurt a bit. Oh, there was a place to hide. Fuck. I forgot! Come on, you can't get me here. If you do, I'll call hacks. Gucci? As soon as I fucking take this, though. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Okay. I need to go down. So this room was just the save point. I'll go ahead and save in the second slot. Not the first one. Let's sweep the meeting room here one more time quickly. What was in here? Antidote, huh? Maybe I use this. I just use the max food to get that health bar up and take the antidote, huh? Nah, it's not like I'm gonna get fucking poisoned by this guy. Never mind. Okay. That takes care of everywhere. So, the guy's ID is in the lower areas, we know that much. Okay. Okay. Down. Don't go to sleep. Okay, hold on. 
First pipe in the first floor lock room. Okay. So... I gotta do something in here, I'm guessing? There's a giant hole in the wall here. I've been working on it quite extensively. I can climb down. Okay. Interesting. Okay. What's this? A body. What's he doing here? Looks like a burrowed through the wall. Okay. Um. I don't know about that, Chief. Oh, so I can go through the cells there. Okay. But then there's the second floor parking lot. The generator's running. I can hide in there. Let's do a quick save in the first slot. Now we're in the evidence storage. Okay. Is this his badge? Yep. Okay. Let's grab this note. And let's see. A white lie. Dad always has been a pain in the ass. It didn't help that he wanted a soup that he was super disappointed with my marks that semester. When I came home with the recorder, he asked me where I got it. I told him I was enrolled in music lessons to get him on my back. Can you believe he smiled? I've honestly never seen the old man so happy. He even offered to pay for after school lessons. Well, how is this for a plan? I took him up on the offer and used that extra pocket change at the PC bang instead. If he tested me, I could belt it out for a few tunes I learned in grade school. <laughs> this goes to an underground parking lot. The door's locked from the side. Gotta find another way, okay. That's fine. Do another quick save, so I'm gonna go back in the room. Okay. Not this one. This one. Yo, 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 old man. I have a spare right here. Did you find my officer badge? Here, you take a gander of that. This as well. I'm a shade of my word. Take this. You receive the replaceable cartridge. Remember, this isn't a toy. Handle it carefully. Okay. Should be able to assemble a defensive weapon with the parts I've collected. I need more time. Let's do it. Let's try inserting the lithium magazine into the grip. I'm, I'm so Oh. Let's try it again. Okay. I think I understand now. I thought it was pointing at something, telling me to do something. It was just a fucking quick time event. Okay. Now snap the replacement cartridge into the grip. Oh, you motherfuckers. They were like, let's do all down except for this one, and then we're gonna fucking change it up on them. So I'm guessing it's gonna be consistent along the, uh... Nope. Okay. Let's try harder this time, y'all. First one's always down, it seems. I was expected to be up, and I was like, oh, oh, got all gotta fuck. Okay. This time for real. Try harding it now. Oh my god, I put it up and to the right. Oh my god, fuck me. We're never gonna get this table right assembled, guys. Oh, up for the first time, huh? Now snap the replacement cartridge out of the grip. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Here she comes. Oh, here she comes. Finished. The power light's on and it looks professional. Never used them before, but with the way the night's going, I'm sure it'll come in handy. Fuck, I think she's like right there. Also, I can't loot things if I uh, have the lighter put away, huh? 
Okay, she walked away. Fuck. Ready, set, go! Yes! Haha, <laughs> fucking dodged, bitch! Fuck. Nope! 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 Fuck you, hater! Okay. <laughs> Almost had me. <laughs> a little close. Oop, here's the save point. Ooh, okay. This looks like a prison cell. Could the dead person have saw it came from in here? Probably. The big man said all I had to do was rile up the others and bring them here with me. He told me to ask to be put in cell block A and that he'd take care of the rest. Some lady's supposed to come here and get me out. And everything's been arranged. I do my part and walk out free with a briefcase full of cash. What's there to lose? Ah, so he must have, uh, like, riled up the protesters or something, I'm guessing. The door is open. This should lead to the right wing of BF1. Okay. Do I need a key to get back in here now? No? Okay, why do I have a key in the lock? Something's coming. Something dark. Something crawled. Prisoner, no. Let me out of here. I'm gonna kill myself. Yada yada. Help, help, help. They told me I would be here for a few hours. Aren't they going to supposed to give me a phone call? It's been a year. Let me out of here. Let me out. been here feeling sick ever since the big man gave me those dumplings yep I think he exploded w what's wrong with my stomach I don't feel pain so well uh, I don't feel so well I think I'm gonna hurt okay I received a torn page music lessons I ran into Myung Gil one day and he threatened to take my money Miss No the music teacher was nearby and I called out to her I gave her dad's cash and said I wanted to join her after school music class to practice a recorder. That got rid of Mungil, but I was still on the hook for music lessons that evening. I was absolutely fuming about the whole situation. With my luck, I remember, uh, wondering whether the recorder was even a legit instrument. Everyone else was studying violin or piano. I was definitely going to look like an idiot. So, rather than... Give him the money. Just this one time. You decided to join the music club and lose out on the money all the time. I mean, nobody ever said criminals were smart. The prison gate's been twisted apart. Did she do this? Well, we're going to use it to our advantage. Hello, notebook. Finally, the prison lobby. I think I can reach the parking lot from here. Oh, I gotta go down. Yep. This must be the gate she mentioned. I don't recognize the sound of those footsteps. I recognize the sound of the footsteps. Any day now. Away from here, that's where I'm going. Get your hands off me. Okay, so if I didn't have the taser, would I have gotten injured or something there? Because I, I could have just not taken the taser, right? 
She's gone. I'm not sure that's the last time I'll see her. Oops. No, Taser Chan. So do I have like parts for that now in my hand? Nope. So I'm I'm really curious if I would have like not had the taser, would I have died? Would I have had to like actually go back and get the taser? I received a torn page. Old sheet music. I got to Miss No's room early. She asked if I had ever played the recorder before, and I told her it was my very first class since grade school. I opened the case and discovered some old sheet music tucked beneath the velvet compartment holding the recorder parts. She reviewed it and said the first few pages were perfect for beginners, although the other pieces looked a little more advanced. I was stuck there, so I gave it a shot. Never in my wildest dreams could I have imagined the new possibilities this would open for me. Challenge accepted. Can you believe it? The music lessons grew on me. After a few months, I even became proficient with the recorder. I'd practiced at home, and that sped up my progress. Miss No told me she'd never seen such quick progress. Who would have known that yours truly had such musical gift? We worked through the sheet music from the easier to the most difficult pieces. There was one piece in particular I couldn't nail. No set it as a milestone challenge for me, and I happily accepted. I started staying in the school even later and continued practicing. Sometimes I was even the last one out. But I was getting closer to my goal. Hey, folks, you, you okay? Y'all in the car, you good? Drive safe. The Kabe Market. Mina, are you okay? I just saw what happened. Barely, she almost gave me a heart attack. It's good that you're prepared for that. That's my teacher. Why the hell is Miss Long trying to kill me? Mina, that's not your teacher. It's a flesh thrall created by and manipulated by a shade I told you about earlier, Vicious Sister. Was Vicious Sister the one that ordered the creature to attack me in the school? It seems you've earned her ire. Shades are extremely territorial, and it's a long story. But Vicious Sister has some unsettled history with Song's family. Anyway, moving on. How the heck am I supposed to get to this apothecarian of yours? There are a lot of shops in the market. He manages the Dubaki Apothecary. There, he is the only one who knows how to make what I need. The Dubaki Apothecary, got it. If it was about you, and just stay on point. Here's the sound of construction. Wait, there are people here working? Something's off. Yeah, they appear to be thralls. Not thralls, but shades, I suppose. So I came from back here. What's this? Couldn't get to the market through this door, but I'll need someone's permission to go through. Why? You can't just open a door? Hello? Y'all okay? You good? This is a subway station exit one. Strange vines have taken root and spread across the gate. Okay. The ladder links to the gate's upper deck. Maybe I can get to the market from there. Hey, excuse me, sir. Yeah, what can you want, girl? What are you guys working on? Are you blind? We're putting up a new gateway to the Dubaki market. The boys have been working overtime trying to get this thing installed right. We've got a deadline to meet, so I'll bid you good night. Wait, please, I don't mean to be a bother, but I really need to get to the market. Jeez, can't you people see this is a construction site? You're the second lady insisting on getting by tonight. I can't even, I can't let every Tim, Dick, and Harry walk through. Find out the door. How about that door over there? Well, it does connect to the market. Please, sir, I need to pick up some medicine for my friend. She's seriously ill. Mmm. All right, all right, go ahead. Remember, that door is one way, got it? Yes, sir. Good luck with your work tonight. Shoot. Maybe I should have asked him about the ladder. Well, let's save in uh, slot two. 
Hey, girl, don't forget the door's gonna be closed. You'll have to knock when you come back. Shadow telecom's ringing again. Young Bay. It, it can't be. I saw his body at school. Be careful. The Bucky Market can be a dangerous place if you don't know what you're doing. Who's this? Hyung Bae? Don't worry about that. I'm trying to help you. But I saw your body at the school. How do you know where I'm at? Never strike deals with shades lightly. Be wary of their tricks. Who are you? Ask the question. A friend. I'm not leaving until I get the medicine. Okay. Dear customers, construction on the market gate will continue until the end of next week. Watch your step when exiting the market. Also, while we do our best to ensure your safety, please be aware of falling objects and stray equipment. Thank you, Supervisor. There's a bunch of assorted wares here. You really wish you had time to look around with all these uh, tentacles mixed in with stuff? Mm. Oh, hey, it's the other woman that we saw in the school. What do you mean you're out of spectral incense? One of my colleagues just bought a stick tonight. You only have one left? Well, I suppose it'll have to do. What type of Mickey Mouse operation is this anyway? What? No, I will not sign my name on that. I know your tricks. You're lucky to be getting this much from me. <laughs> a little bird decided to leave her nest. Do I know you? Ah, and the poor deer is still clueless as ever. You're dressed in an additional... Uh, Shama Shamanka? I wonder what she's doing here. Who are you? You may call me Jang Mi. Now, why don't you tell me what you're doing here? A little girl like you shouldn't be wandering around strange places at night. Why so condescending? This is my neighborhood. I shop at this market with my mom all the time. Oh, no, 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 you don't. Not this market. You'll figure it out soon enough. Trust me, the alternative is undesirable. Now then, why don't you buzz off? You're boring me, and I have important matters to attend to. Oh, and don't do anything stupid while you're here. Okay. Bitch. I don't have a map of this place yet. Okay. What if I go in here? No, I'll give this light or something. It's very... Um... It lasts a while. Ooh, a note. I'm going to assume. Oh, wow, that's a ways down. Ooh, green tea. Yeah, I don't have any room for that, though. A51-1. That's nice. Ah, hello there. Hello, floating lady. Don't mind me. See the market map. The map's layout looks different. I can hardly recognize the place now. This map should come in handy. Oh boy! That's a big old map. So I can go there. Excuse me, ma'am. Hey, what's this? Hey, 51. Hell yeah. Seafood. I don't know. I want to go up higher. That looks like a fun place. I don't know why I always do that to those places. Construction will continue, yada yada. My inventory's full. Ooh. Alright. Progress has been saved. I found an antidote. They give you a lot of items. Good with that, but it's not like I really need them. All right. <sighs> anyway, I think that we will go ahead and end things here for right now, everyone. It's been interesting. It hasn't been really spooky. The uh, spookiest stuff, I suppose, is when the ghosts just kind of... Not the ghosts, the, the creatures, the things, the flesh thralls kind of just show up and are like, hey, I'm going to kill you. And then it's kind of like, okay, let me just run away from you. It's not really scary, I would say. Like, 
even the introductions to them. It would be a little bit scarier if they, like, didn't give you the whole, like, cutscene thing. It made it feel, like, a little more spooky. Like, it's got a good atmosphere to it, don't get me wrong. But Anyway, I think we might play some of this tomorrow as well. See if, uh, it, it hooks me in or not. Could go either way. But, uh, definitely play some more of it tomorrow. And then, uh, yeah, kind of go from there, so... Uh, as I mentioned at the beginning of the stream, I now have a Twitter that you guys can follow. It is at Plagin Gaming, all one word there, no underscores or anything like that. Um, the link to that is in the stream below, and is also in the, the YouTube comments here as well, if you want to go to that. Um, I also have my... YouTube channel renamed to a different URL than it was before so if you want to catch the VODs or you want to catch more of these videos going up if you're on YouTube and this is your first video of mine you're seeing the URL for that is youtube.com slash plaguenshiki just like the Twitch channel um, same spelling and everything that's P-L-A-G-E-N-S-H-I-K I. So, feel free to uh, jump over there, drop a subscription. In addition to you know these these gameplay videos, I also read stories. Um, if you're interested in some audiobook kind of stuff, if you like my voice, apparently a bunch of people do. I don't know why. I personally cannot stand the sound of my own voice, but yeah. So, um, if you were previously following my Plagin Gaming YouTube channel. You want to make sure to um, follow my Plague and Shiki YouTube channel because Plague and Shiki is my main channel, and I am discontinuing the Plague and Gaming channel. So yeah, and uh, we'll just kind of go from there. So next time we'll be playing more of this tomorrow. Going to be starting around 6 p.m. Going for a couple of hours. I don't want to do too long of streams if it's you know just. Uh, a couple people watching here, but we will get a little bit more done tomorrow. And then also, my plan is on every day except for Tuesdays, I'm going to try and maybe stream Fallout 76 um, and just do my dailies. Um, just because it, it's something that I do every day anyway, and there's not a whole lot else that's going on when I'm doing those. So I figured, you know what, why not at least stream it? And if people want to come and hang out, they can. If not, it's whatever. So, But I thank you all for watching and sticking around. And you all have a lovely time. Bye-bye. For now.